Ernte Denkfest is how you say uh, Thanksgiving in German. Ernte Denkfest. German's first Let's Thanksgiving. Go. First Thanksgiving? Yeah, baby. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. Hello? Wie geht's dir? I just want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Skillshare. And thank you for understanding that these sponsorships allow me to make even better content for you guys. And as you know, I do not do a lot of sponsored videos because I'm only going to partner with companies that are going to bring you something that could potentially enrich your life. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of classes geared toward creative and curious people like me and you. I was on the website for a few hours and I found classes exactly geared toward what I love. Documentary filmmaking, piano, and of course, German. The best thing about it is the skills that you will learn are taught by people who have done what they're teaching you. For example, this storytelling one-on-one -on -one class taught by Daniel Jose Older, New York Times best-selling author. In anything that you want to get good at, the best people to learn from are those that have done it. And Skillshare is basically a hub of mentors for any skill that you might want to learn. The annual subscription is less than $10 a month, but the first 1,000 people that click the link in the top of the description will get a free trial of Skillshare premium membership. Also, for those of you who sign up online, send me a screenshot of your confirmation email to Boom Baby Let's Go Club in the DMs, and you will be entered into the start of a very exclusive club. Let's go. And remember, the most beautiful thing in this world is a beautiful mind, so I would definitely spend time enriching your own. And I hope the rest of this video enriches your mind, too. <laughs> Boom Baby Let's Go! See that? I literally just demolished a whole celery. That's how you stay healthy. Today, we're having American Thanksgiving with more of our German friends, and we're gonna try to show them what it's like to have an American Thanksgiving. We're gonna go shopping, we're gonna go eat with our friends, so that should be fun. Thank you guys for watching the videos, and let's go! No way! That's nice, huh? Lit. <laughs> go, go, go. They stop for you in Germany. This is something that my sister's had to get used to. Like in America, you have to stop for the cars. Here, if they see you about to cross the rock, the walkway, they'll stop like 20 feet ahead. And we just, we're always waiting because as Americans, we expect the cars to go. We've learned that the Germans wait for us and we we appreciate that, so, danke schön. Yeah, in America, you had to always look out. Yeah. Because there's so many times I'm running and I've almost gotten hit a few times, but I had to look out for them. Because people are driving, they're a lot more distracted. And Try to say them. this yeah, word. For a guest in information. For guest in information. Yeah, yeah. Dude, see, look, this is the bond. It's going in a tunnel. So dope. Ah, cool. Not good. <laughs> He put it down so I can see. Yeah, dude, one of the best places to sit is the very front, so you can see the train going. It's kind of cool, it's like a ride, you know? I love the U-Bahn so much. I looked at the history of this cylinder building. I was looking up online, just like historical sites around Stuttgart, and this building literally right there that says Male, it's now used for businesses, but it, during World War II, it was used for an anti-aircraft gun, and they just kept it, and now they use it for business. So it's pretty interesting, you know? Also, I don't know why, there's a lot of Germans looking at me weird, because I have Birkenstocks and shorts on, but I thought like true Germans wear this in the winter. I don't know what the problem is, guys. I'm kidding, it's freaking cold. This is like where the soccer games are. Look at this uh, statue, I kind of like that. Guy just chilling. Oh, I like this area. Yeah. We should go down here more. Dude, yeah, when this is open, it's gonna be legit down here. Okay, 
Something that's also really German. I have to bring my sisters. Come here. See these? These birds? These are so that birds, birds don't, don't hit, hit the glass. How does that help? Like, <laughs> like they see the color, right? And so they, there's nothing? Can they see that? Was it clear? <laughs> no. But like a German told me that one time. And I don't know, there's so, scrapes on so it. So anytime you see, hmm. anytime you see like a bird on the glass, it's like so the birds don't like run through it and die, I think. I think sure? it makes sense. I'm not sure, but is that what it's for? Someone told me that. I think it, that's what it's for. I'm skeptical. <laughs> what I think do you, it what would do you think it's for? Um, decoration. <laughs> Maybe. But it doesn't look good. It's not a good decoration. Yeah, I'm gonna go back home and be like, our cars are huge. Yeah, compared to this little one? Yeah. Hey, we have to go to this place right here. Okay, this is probably the German store that we've been most excited about visiting since we got here. We haven't done it yet. Pflanzenwolle. Or Kohle. Pflanzenkohle. Go, 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 go. So now starts the shopping for the Thanksgiving meal. This is not a joke. Like the grocery store carts in Germany, like I can just move it to the left and to the right so easily. And Germans might be thinking, what? That's normal, right? No. In American grocery stores, the wheels, not all the time, but most of the time, are like stuck together and rusted together. So you can roll forward fine, but sideways, it's like really, really difficult. If someone wants you to like get out of the way, in Germany you can just go like this. But in the US you have to be like, okay. Wait, no way. How yeah. Do you know that? Look how easy it is. That's so nice. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Germans understand how things should work. German engineering. Is that honey? Okay, so Casey is having difficulty because she's shopping in German. <laughs> she's struggling. Ah. Okay, how do you say goat cheese? You can do so. I'm looking for a ham. Do they sell like big fat hams in Germany? Because they have all this Scheibenfleisch. Aber ich muss um, bezahlen ein großer uh, Schwein, Schwein. Ham. Okay. You see that little number 102? This is also different about German grocery stores is you have to pick the number or remember the number of what you bought and then you put it on this little scale and then it prints out exactly the price for the weight that you got. So I'll show you right here. Definitely the... Thanksgiving, everyone. Look at this little tree. It's in the middle of the city, just, just chilling. All chilling and stuff. I am obsessed with jumpies now. My friend Ludia showed us jumpies. Now, every time I go to the store, I buy jumpies. Anybody else in Germany like that? Hey, I told them I'm obsessed with jumpies because of you. Is it, this is dein Lieblings. Jumpies. Was ist der Name? Snack? Auf Deutsch? Snack? Imbiss? Yeah. Mm. Nein? Mm. Schnack is a German word? Yeah, you can say all yeah. the snack. My Lieblings German Schnack, File Ludia, is because it's jumpies. 30 minutes. We should probably start with these, I think. Start with cooking, yo. But let's see how long we I love this place. Best ambiance in Germany. Say my name, say my name. My name is Potato, and I am Kartoffelin. Oh 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 oh. Ich bin jetzt in a uh, uh, Schlossplatz in der Stadt mit der Stuttgart. My erste Mal seeing the lights. This is my first time seeing the Christmas lights. I don't know if this is how it's gonna be fully, but it's so sick to see the lights, bro. We're gonna walk in there. And the reason why I'm here is because I left my drone at uh, the house that we had Thanksgiving at yesterday. So I have to come pick it up from George and Natasha. And yeah, we're gonna enjoy the lights. And then I'm gonna get back on the train and go eat Thanksgiving meal. This is unbelievable. Look at this tree sparkling. Oh yeah, I love trees, but I love Christmas. Look 
this tree, got a little manger. Boom, that's straight out of the Schwarzwald. Glaube ich das. Und look at that, and look at the moons out, bro, and everyone's out. The moons out, the Christmas trees out, the, the Leute, alles die Leute von Stuttgart are out. Oh, dude, they got a little bit, they got some of the stalls out too. Right here, they're selling Lebkuchenherz und Frucht mit Schoko on top. Two lives. Yo! Yeah, it's crazy. Aubergine? Yeah. With salt? With salt. Yeah, with salt. And cream. Hey, what you guys got? Yeah. What you guys got? Uh, casserole? Casserole. Mashed potatoes. Profi cooked. Well, the casseroles aren't done yet because there's no onions. Oh, I need to get onions. Yeah. Yeah, I'm slacking. I gotta get onions. What is this called? Schweinsachse? Schweinhassler? This is Kassler. Kassler? Kassler, yeah. Check it. Schweinkassler. Check out that cut, bro. Thick. Mm. Mm. Almost ready. Almost ready. Almost ready. Show Prost. Prost. German's first Let's Thanksgiving. Go. First Thanksgiving? Yes, first oh. time. First Thanksgiving? Excited. Is this outside? Hey, huh? first Thanksgiving? Yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> this is first Thanksgiving? Uh, no. Nice. nice. We just said a little prayer. Now, what is traditional in America? In our family, what we do, we get a plate, we go into the kitchen, and then everybody just <laughs> takes what they want. And then we come sit down and we eat. Oh, nice. Oh. Du musst probieren. Du musst probieren alles. Du musst probieren alles. Oh. Ja, ja. Lecker, lecker, lecker. Yeah, this is Benny's first time. This is what a Thanksgiving plate looks like. Like that, yeah. I'm really excited. A bunch of different stuff and you just mix it all up. And okay, so so that's ma mashed potatoes? Yeah, mashed potatoes here, mm -hmm. gravy. And what's that? You got the so green beans with the uh, fried, onions. fried onions. And then okay. you got ham. Uh -huh. And then fruit salad with yogurt. It's so crazy that you guys put it on together. Like yeah, on the, a lot of people, it, like like me, a lot of people, I take a bite, but I have like three different things on. Like I have ham yeah. with green beans and and mashed potatoes in one bite. So it's up really? to you. It's up to you. That's crazy. Yeah, your choice. Nine child. Because usually we would put it on in like a separate plate. Really? Like, yeah, like dessert and eat it afterwards. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, that's like. That's is that's typisch American. Excited for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go! Give gas, give gas. Give <laughs> gas. What do the Germans think of their first Thanksgiving? Geil. Mm. Mm. It's good, really. Yeah. Geil. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
at that. That's spider webs and stuff. What we were thinking is maybe we can make this into like a little club. Put a little bar right there. Some lights. And then when all of the Alte Deutsche are schlafen, dann wir machen. Never before done. <laughs> Jumpies, mid. The reason why I'm doing this is because like the green beans have the fried onions. And this is like just fried stuff too. And I love jumpies, so I think it'd be a good geschmack zusammen. Like, so good yeah. cook das. It's like stroganoff, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zum Wohl. Zum Wohl. Zum Wohl. Zum Wohl.